at the age of 15, I came down with rheumatic fever. The rheumatic fever is damaged, an aortic valve. I got schooled by the Navy. I transferred to the Air Force, and I ended up fixing the aircraft. Over the period of years, had a damaged valve to eventually make your heart enlarge. And when we got to 2020, the doctor says, we got to give you an LVAD. In the LVAD world, the pump is to help a heart that is failing that no longer can pump adequate amount of blood supply to the rest of the body. So the pump itself is implanted directly into the left ventricle. A tube called a driveline connects the pump to an external power source, and where this tube exits the body can be very vulnerable to infection, and which makes the driveline exit site dressing so important. We teach our patients that if an infection starts at the exit site of a driveline, it's going to go to their pump. There's really no clear defined guidelines from the CDC or Joint Commission regarding how dressings are supposed to be managed. These patients were changing their dressings every three to four days, sometimes more often due to um, humidity or due to their, their lifestyle. Recently, I got in, involved with uh, Eloquist, who has a gum mastic adhesive and a remover, and learned about the vascular access guidelines and recommendations. And then I compared those to the LVAD ICAC recommendations, which also said that frequency of seven plus days was recommended. I realized that by adding this gum mastic adhesive could potentially elongate their dressing frequency to seven plus days and hopefully improve their quality of life by also maintaining an infection-free atmosphere. We conducted a study and found that 98% of our gum mastic adhesive patients were able to keep their dressing in place for seven plus days, while the control group averaged about four and a half days. That drive line unit comes right out of my body and we have to keep it com completely sealed because any kind of bacteria, even from the air, can get in. So when she applied the bandages on me today, it's actually airtight and it's sealed. And they do last seven days. I've done it. It works. I'm basically living today on state of the art. My body's come back to normal. Everything functions just perfect. My legs don't swell. I just can't believe how well I feel.